what's going on guys arrow here and guys we're getting closer and closer to january 12th for that nintendo switch event and today i have another video for you guys on another nintendo game and what i'd like to see for it on the nintendo switch and the game that we're going to be talking about today is mario kart because as you know in the reveal trailer for the nintendo switch mario kart was also shown off they actually showed it off in like a car they were playing mario kart with the two joy con controllers it was really cool it looks a lot of fun and there's definitely some new things that were in that Mario Kart game as well and so it definitely makes sense that this Mario Kart game is going to be different than Mario Kart 8 and so it looks like it's going to be a great game and so in this video I'm going to be talking to you guys about everything that I'd like to see in a brand new Mario Kart game for the Nintendo Switch and so yeah let's get started. Alright, so this first thing is something that everybody wants, and so do I, new characters. And obviously in every Mario Kart game we get new characters, and I'm almost certain that new characters are going to be coming into Mario Kart for the Nintendo Switch as well. I mean, in the reveal trailer itself, we can see King Boo as one of the characters that someone is playing as, and King Boo isn't a normal playable character in uh, Mario Kart 8, so I would love to see more characters come into Mario Kart as well. Hopefully they actually choose some good characters and stuff, and I hope that they actually like, switch some things around and have more slots available for characters because I really don't like what they did with the Koopalings in Mario Kart 8. Now don't get me wrong, I love being able to play as the Koopalings, but I don't like how they're their own separate character slot for every single one. Like I think that that's a waste of seven different slots because each of them is a Koopaling. I think they should have done what they did in like Super Smash Brothers where for Bowser Jr. you can just like click on different options and stuff to have like which Koopaling you want. I think they could just do that and now you have seven slots that are open for this Mario Kart game so I think that's what they should do and speaking of Bowser Jr. that is definitely one character that I'd like to see return in Mario Kart um, Bowser Jr. was in Mario Kart Wii and I really liked it. Um, you know, Mario Kart Wii actually has like my favorite roster of all time and I would love to see a lot of those characters come back into the Mario Kart for the Nintendo Switch as well. So I would like to see uh, Bowser Jr., Diddy Kong, Birdo, Dry Bones, um, we already have Dry Bowser, maybe like Funky Kong, stuff like that, maybe even like Rob the Robot from uh, Mario Kart DS, any of those characters, uh, I like. I love pretty much all of those old characters that we had in previous Mario Kart games, pretty much all of those types of characters, I really like them, and I would love to see all of those characters return onto Mario Kart for the Nintendo Switch as well, and if you're talking about new characters, I'm not really sure which ones I'd like to see, uh, You maybe you guys can comment some down below that you would like to see, um, yeah, maybe new Mario characters, I'm not really sure what I would like to see, maybe, um, I don't know, maybe like the Piantas that they had in like Super Mario Sunshine or something like that. I don't really mind what we get as a new character, even if they plan on doing like the whole Smash Bros. Mario Kart thing kind of, where like they would have other characters from other franchises like in Mario Kart as well. Like they had, they had Link like driving in Mario Kart. I wouldn't mind if like Kirby or someone like that came into Mario Kart as well, especially after seeing that Rosalina and Luma trailer like a while back when he saw Kirby in that Mario Kart trailer. I would love to see Kirby in a Mario Kart game. Game. And so yeah, there's a lot of characters. I would love to see new characters be added and hopefully there's a good amount and hopefully they're smart about their characters and don't do something like King Boo and nine different color toads. Alright, so what's a new Mario Kart game without new tracks? I'm almost certain that new tracks are going to be coming onto Mario Kart for this Nintendo Switch as well, and I don't really have any hopes for like which types of tracks I'd like to see, but there's definitely a lot of cool tracks that I'd like to see return as well, and I actually want any old Rainbow Road to return into the new version of Mario Kart for the Switch as well, and the reason that I'm saying that is because if we have one more Rainbow Road added onto the Nintendo Switch version, uh, assuming that all the DLC is coming onto the Nintendo Switch as well, then that means we'll have four Rainbow Roads and we could have an entire rainbow road cup and i think that that would be really cool or something like that just to have four rainbow roads in one game i think it'll be really cool and you know there's obviously going to be a lot of other cool tracks that i'd like to see as well but yeah i definitely do want to see new tracks be added into this version of mario kart yeah. 
Now, Mario Kart games have always been really simple. We haven't had any diverse modes in Mario Kart for a long time, and I think that it's definitely necessary for Mario Kart to receive some new modes. Now, from what the rumors are saying, it definitely looks like that uh, the battle mode is going to be getting like a revamp in this version because the battle mode for the Mario Kart 8 was really bad and it just wasn't fun. So I'm almost certain that we're going to be getting a revamped uh, battle mode for Mario Kart on the Switch. But I want to see some other modes as well. I don't know what Nintendo could do, but they're always clever with the modes that they could come up with. I don't just want the Grand Prix, the verse mode, and the battle mode. I like how they have time trials and stuff like that. I want some other types of modes as well. And you know, I really want some other ways that I could play Mario Kart instead of just racing around. Maybe they could have some other types of things like you have to get through cones and stuff or like drift in a certain direction. Kind of like the missions that they had in Mario Kart DS. Like I was a really big fan of all those missions. I definitely do want something like that in Mario Kart for the Switch as well. So give me more types of modes. That is definitely something that I really want to see. See. Alright, so obviously if it's a brand new Mario Kart game, I want new carts as well. Um, so yeah, this is a really simple thing. I'm almost certain we're going to be getting new cars and parts for all of our different options and stuff like that. But I really do want to see a, a big diverse option of new carts and stuff. I don't want just like two carts and two wheels and, you know, a couple gliders added. I do want to see a good amount of that. So hopefully they added a lot of cool things. I really like the whole like concept they had with a whole bunch of the cars and ATVs that they made in Mario Kart 8. Hopefully they come up with some clever things like that for this version as well. And yeah, I just want to see some really cool, uh, unique carts, gliders, and wheels. Alright, now this next thing is definitely something that I'm almost certain isn't going to happen, but I would love to see it. And I'm talking about a track builder in Mario Kart. Now, we've already seen how much fun it is to make your own Mario levels in Super Mario Maker, and how much fun do you think it would be to make your own tracks in Mario Kart? And I'm not talking about like a really complex thing to build your own tracks, kind of like the stage builder in Super Smash Bros. It's not really complicated, and you only have a few things, and I think that if they did something like that for Mario Kart, it would be so much fun. Like if I got my Nintendo Switch and I got that tablet part and I could take my finger and just drag over an area and like make like a little shape of like what I want my track to look like and then I could just drag item boxes over like where I want the items to appear. I could cut out little sections to make flying sections and there could be like a little water icon I could drag over to see, uh, put like where I want the water to be for underwater like parts of the track. I think if they made like a really simple track builder like that it would just be so much fun. I could race on my own tracks that I created with my my friends if I set up a private lobby online I could invite people to play on my tracks I think it would just be a lot of fun you should be able to share your tracks online and stuff like that I just think it would be a lot of fun and so yeah I would like to see some type of track builder but I don't think that that's gonna happen Alright, so the last thing that I would like to see in Mario Kart on the Nintendo Switch is voice chat. And I'm not talking about voice chat like how it was in Mario Kart 8, because that voice chat wasn't fun at all. And if you guys never tried voice chat on Mario Kart 8, you were only able to do it in the lobby when you guys were choosing tracks. And that isn't fun at all. I want to see voice chat be implemented while I'm racing, and that's a lot of fun. Because if I'm playing against my friends, if I throw a blue shell at them, I want to hear their frustration through my headphones and that's a lot of fun. If I'm, you know, getting hit by a red shell, I want my friend to feel my anger as well. I just think voice chat is a lot of fun in Mario Kart, and I really want voice chat to be implemented. I think it would be so much fun if I'm actually racing against my friend, and if I, you know, hit them and stuff like that, they can actually, like, see that, and then they can talk back to me, and instead of opening up a Skype call or something, I can just have that right here on my headphones. I think it's definitely something to have in Mario Kart. It would just be a lot of fun, and so that's the last thing that I'd like to see added into Mario Kart on the Nintendo Switch. So there you guys go. That is everything that I'd like to see in Mario Kart on the Nintendo Switch. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to click that like button. It really does help me out. And definitely comment some things that you would like to see down below for Mario Kart on the Nintendo Switch as well. I'm always curious to see what you guys have to say. And as always, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to click that like button. Go follow me on Twitter at Actual Arrow for video updates and interactions. And be sure to subscribe to the channel if you're enjoying the Nintendo content and you're hyped for the Nintendo Switch as well. Thank you so much for watching. Thank <laughs> you.